I'm Maddie with Maddie Sews, and thanks for hanging with me. So today is Vlogmas Day 12, and you all, this day has really kind of gotten away from me. But you all, in the middle of my Santa hat making, my sewing machine went down. Now, I have this really old um, Bernina 1120 machine. It's, um, I think it was made in the 1980s, early 1980s. So... It went down for the second time in three months. The feed dog stopped working. So I decided to run it over to the repair shop, which just so happens to be G Street Fabrics. Now, you all, I love that fabric shop. <laughs> I really do. So I dropped my machine off. I shopped for fabric. And then I shopped for a brand new machine. This one. I got this. This right here. Okay, okay, hang on. Put it down, it's heavy. I just got back home with this machine and I'm super excited to set it up and finish out some of these projects. And let me just say that actually trying out the different Bernina machines while I was at G Street Fabric was just so exciting. And you all, I mean, I did not take it easy on those machines. Mm -mm. I mean, I took a pack of leather needles and a whole bunch of leather and I layered it all together and ran it up under those machines and I have to admit they really kind of performed much better than I thought they would. So you can see all the different sewing machine models here. Um, some of them are really fancy and you know what really caught my eye was their extra super duper fancy ironing board and iron. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Long story short, I ended up getting the Bernina 535 and while I was waiting for her to kind of get all of that stuff together, I decided to walk around the fabric shop and you all, oh they have some beautiful stuff there. Their special occasion fabrics are like none other. I just drool at the sight of all of their sequins. <laughs> you know, good thing I was wearing a mask. I did stop by their $3 room. So they have a room where everything on the table and it's just like kind of just thrown in there. It's all $2.97 a yard. So I picked up two different fabrics. I picked up this really nice stretched woven. Now it is black with rose gold pinstripes on it. And honestly, I thought that this would be perfect for a pair of pants. So I did get three yards of this with the idea to actually make some pants at work. Um, you all stretch wovens. I I'm feeling like that's gonna be the way to go for some nice professional looking but still comfy type of pants. The other fabric I picked up was actually um, one that I had in mind with some of my athletic stuff that I make. So I got this netting right here. And honestly, it's super stretchy. It's in one of my favorite colors, fuchsia. So I'm actually thinking that I'm going to make a top, or um, maybe two, out of this fabric. I got about two yards of it. But you are, I mean, I have tons of pink athletic wear. I have lots of pink tights. And so I thought that this would go really nicely with all of that. And at $3 a yard, you really can't beat it. I'm not going to lie. Sometimes I walk into that $3 room and I'm, it's just kind of, you have to be in the mood to hunt because all of the fabric is literally just thrown onto shelves. It's kind of like balled up. And sometimes when you're pulling fabric out of there, it's twisted around other, other fabrics and you have to pull it and untwist. It's, it could be a real mess, honestly. And actually that's what I did with that black fabric with the rose gold pinstripes. But I felt like that was, that was worth the work. <laughs> If you're ever in Maryland or the DC area, I would highly recommend that you at least stop by G Street Fabrics to check out their, what they have going on there, their $3 room, even their special occasion stuff if you're looking for a amazing fabric for a special dress. So that is all I have for you today because I need to set up this machine and finish up my Christmas projects, you all. I know that this video was a bit of a weird one, but if you're curious about the different projects that I'm going to be making, check out this video right over here. And you all, until next time, I sincerely hope that you find joy and have a wonderful day.